And now, your live Doppler 18 forecast with meteorologist Sarah McKenna. Weather from where you live. Good morning. Well, we are starting off nice and clear, at least as far as the sky cover goes. We do have some fog on the ground, though, so keep that in mind as you head off to work today. Otherwise, clear conditions. It looks like, in fact, we're going to be seeing some of that sunshine this morning as we go a little bit into the later morning hours. But by the afternoon, I am expecting us to see that chance of rain build in. You can see pretty clear conditions for Lafayette. The storms, a lot of them moving out of our area, at least where it looks like to be some of the heavier storms. But you will notice more are popping up. You can see one that kind of developed just to the south of St. Louis. But then, of course, the ones we're keeping our eye on are back across Minnesota, coming down into Iowa right now. Those are expected to be moving this way, and we do have another chance of rain, especially as we head into the late afternoon or early evening hours. Now, temperature-wise, we are starting off pretty warm, 71 degrees right now in Lafayette and a muggy 71 at that. Future cast shows that it looks like we're going to stay pretty clear through the day. I'm going with partly cloudy conditions today, and future cast actually doesn't bring any rain until the overnight hours. Again, I expect us to see some as early as the late afternoon or early evening hours, but you'll notice that Tuesday looks like we're going to be pretty soggy. So if you have to have outdoor plans, I'd really try to do them today. Your rain chance, they only about a 30% chance of rain, so it's not going to be a complete washout. Tuesday, however, looks to be a little bit more soggy. You can kind of see several waves that come through our area some of which look to be pretty heavy. We are under a slight risk of severe weather for Tuesday, and what I'm expecting mainly is to see heavy wind once again. We saw that, of course, on Saturday, what the wind damage can do. Wednesday, it looks like a few more showers as well. For today, some morning fog, partly cloudy conditions. Again, rain showers possible, especially during the afternoon, 90 for your high. Tonight, the clouds are going to increase. A rain and thunderstorms begin as well, 70 for your low. Then going into your day on Tuesday, areas of rain, it looks like some thunderstorms are going to be embedded, embedded within it as well, and 70, or 87 for your high. Taking a look at the rest of your seven-day forecast, you'll notice that we are expecting to see rain pretty much throughout the week. Tuesday, though, really is a bullseye day. We were kind of expecting that last week as well as we have a front pushing through. And the reason it's such an extended chance of rain is because fronts have literally lined up one after another. We're kind of in this pattern where they just keep kind of moving across mm -hmm. our area. So we get hit with one, it starts to leave, but another one's on the way. So that's why there's rain chances really throughout the week. So Tuesday, Thursday, and I'd say again on Saturday, kind of our bullseye days there. So, But otherwise, watch out for more rain. Absolutely. Yeah. Or guess hit or miss. Exactly.